Hello everyone, this is just a quick video in relation to HD0 and head tracking. So if you don't know, uh, HD0 goggles do have a wired head tracking via this port right here. And uh, this is going to be a short video uh, that will show you how to set it up. So the first thing you want to do before getting anything is go and get yourself one of these. It's a standard stereo 3.5 millimeter um, cable. I just got one meter because it will do me from my local shop, but um, anything will do as long as they're 3.5 millimeter. It's a 3.5 millimeter stereo. Make sure they're stereo. So three pole. The next thing you want to do is head over to the GitHub. So you can type in HD zero goggles GitHub. Now, this has the most current firmware. You want to click here. You want to go over to this side that says releases. And you want to download at least version 8. And that has the wired head tracking. So, I'm not going to tell you how to flash that. But basically, you download this asset. It should be the bin file. Put it on there. Go to the menu and go flash. Very simple, very, very simple. Now, the next thing you wanna do is, let's turn on the radio. Welcome to Crossfire. And you're gonna to wanna to make yourself a model. So, here we are. So, you wanna go model select. This is just on my T18. And you wanna go create model. Disregard all that, or you can do it to an existing model. <clears throat> so that's, you got your model set up and you wanna go into your mixes page. Now, we're going to, uh, we're gonna power on the goggles. And we're gonna put the cable right here. And we're gonna get some of this fancy HDMI output goodness that it does all right so once you power on everything you want to plug one side into your radio into the trainer port which is usually a 3.5 millimeter jack plug it straight in and you want to plug the other end into the head tracker port of the goggles, which is right here, right next to the power side. So you want to plug that in as well. Alrighty. So now we've got that set up. How do we start the head tracking? So we hold the menu and then we go down to head tracker very very simple and then what we want to do is we want to turn it on so this is all controlled by the the wheel so very, very simple there we go even the radio picks it up let's turn the volume down now we want to calibrate it so we want to put it on a level surface and calibrate it so it's going to be hard to do with all these connections in but we want to put it on a level surface and go calibrate it's going to calibrate it and then we're going to recenter it so let's just center it right there that's going to give us the best part now what we do is we come over to our radio now that's plugged in the radio is detecting there is a trainer signal now, I'm gonna put it on five, six, and seven. So, number five, we're just gonna click and create a new mix. We're gonna source, and we're gonna change it to trainer. And we're gonna change it to trainer one, because that is what the pan system is set up. There you go. It's already working. Look at that matches the screen 
on um, the goggles and on the trainer. So there you go. That's how you do pan. So now we want to do, let's go six, same thing. Let's go trainer. But this time we're going to undo it on number two. Now that's actually the tilt. See, they both match tilt. Very, very simple. And then next one, or the last one, trainer, we're going to put it on three. Now, if you haven't guessed, that's the roll. And it all works just beautifully. So if we have a look at channels, let's have a look there. Uh, channels five, six, and seven, they will all move according. So there you go. Let's have a look at that. So there's my roll, there's my pan, and there's my tilt. So there's a lot of functionality in this. So yeah, all you need to do, download at least, um, or at least candidate eight, get a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, uh, headphone cable, and then make sure that pan is on trainer one, tilt is on trainer two, and roll is on trainer three. And that will get you head tracking on the HD zero goggles. So thank you very much for my video guys. Uh, if you liked uh, this video and if it helped you click the like button, click subscribe, and hopefully I can do more videos on these goggles because they are absolutely amazing. So yeah, thanks. And I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.